This is a tutorial video of a case study for Bluetooth sensors. Marvel Comic found me. It's a kind of beacon to help you find your things. When you are browsing the Found Me website, you can see this brand is working with lots of comic or film brands including Marvel. The landing page has a very attractive red banner for Marvel. When you click on this button, it jumps into an introduction page to tell you the function of the product. You can also check out these beacons designed in two different comic characters. Let's focus on Marvel ones. Here are four different characters. When you click them, you will be led to an e-commerce page which introducing the product in a character's tone. Then you will start thinking that the character really helps you to tag your things and protecting your stuff in case they are lost. They are super cool because you can always track your important stuff. Beacons and proximity are most commonly used for indoor navigation, asset tracking, employee tracking, keyless access proximity marketing, data generation, and more. As to the future of beacon technology, it's predicted that the changing market will make itself felt by 2021, at which point Bluetooth accessories, such as keyboards, Wearables and audio equipment will rise to 13% of all Bluetooth products shipped, as will beacons, which are expected to ship 565 million units in 2021, a huge increase over the 8.2 million units in 2016 because Bluetooth 5 has far greater range than earlier iterations. Alongside greater power efficiency, device developers will be able to use beacons and include them in far more products. For example, beacons can benefit tourist boards by letting them electronically identify places of interest. A city guide app on a tourist smartphone can then automatically provide relevant information centered on their proximity to the beacon. Government bodies can also use beacons in this way. They can identify a specific location, such as a hospital or a particularly busy road, and provide up-to-date information on waiting times and traffic levels via an associated app or smartphone. And universities can adopt similar beacon applications, using them to ascertain exactly where people are on campus at any given time.